Listen to the interview and decide which facts are true, false, or not stated in it. Good morning, sir. May I ask you a few questions? Certainly. What would you like to know? You work in a very unusual theatre in Moscow. What theatre is it? It's the Moscow State Opera and Ballet Theatre for young audience. People also call it the Natalia Satz Theatre. Natalia Satz is a legendary woman, isn't she? She is. She founded our theatre in 1965 and was its director for a very long time. We can call Natalia Ilinichna the mother of children's theatres throughout the world because hers was the first professional music theatre in the world. Altogether, she organized six theatres of this kind. If I'm not mistaken, her father, Ilya Sartz, was a composer and wrote music for the Stanislavski Moscow Art Theatre. It's really so. From her early childhood, Natalia grew up amongst some of the greatest Russian actors. Theatre and music became her world and her lifelong love. Does your theatre show performances for children only? In fact, we have real opera and ballet performances for children, for young people and for family audiences. As you see, grown-ups also come and enjoy our shows too. So, your theatre stages both operas and ballets? Not only. We present classical and modern operas and ballets, give symphony concerts and special educational programs for people of different ages, where we tell people about music, opera and ballet. I suppose it's correct to say that everyone can find something to their taste in your theatre. Our idea is to present to the audience the greatest opera and ballet music of different periods and to speak to children in the language of modern art. I believe it's very important to help children learn to listen to music, to feel its beauty. Music makes our lives rich and more colorful. It's absolutely true, and that's what we always remember. When I say we, I mean a big symphony orchestra of more than 100 musicians, an opera company with 75 singers, and a ballet company with about 60 dancers. All of them are first-class professionals. Let me wish you the best of luck and success.